What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, today we are going to do some pattern tests and the main reason being is, is we have a new gun, new choke, and really just want to see what they're doing. They've been shooting good for us, but we figured it'd be a good day to shoot them on paper and see what happens. So I will forewarn you, this is not going to be your standard pattern test with a 30 inch circle. This is just the way I've always patterned and I like it and it works. So you'll see eventually here the, the target we have up. It's, uh, it's a pretty decent sized piece of paper and kind of similar to a goose body. So what we have um, in summary is two different guns, two different chokes and four different loads we're going to run through them. Um, the Migras being the majority of them, but uh, the next clip here you'll see each one what's going to be up will let you know what is going on in each of these clips so that you understand what we're shooting and um, that's it we'll go from there all right guys so for this video it's going to be all about the impala plus and the carlson cremator long range so what we're going to do is keep one choke in this gun for this particular video and we're going to run four different shells through it uh, we have three Migra loads and one Federal BB uh, speed chalk that we're going to run through it. So this is all steel shot. Um, the Migras are going to be a one and three stack, a two and BB stack. We have twos and fours. And then the Federal, like I said, the speed chalk is going to be BB. First up is going to be the Migra. Uh, this is a stacked load. Three inch, one and three. Um, I've been shooting this quite a bit for goose and really like it. So. We're going to run this one first, see what happens. And so I forgot to mention, this is also all at 40 yards. Um, 40 is just my go-to for testing this stuff because 20, 30, just about anything patterns pretty good. 40 is iffy, so that's where this is all going to yeah. All right, guys, so this was the um, Impala Plus with three inch Migra one and three load. Actually, not bad. Um, pretty surprised at what that did at 40. I did a video on Federal Speed Shock BB last year, and um, I really wasn't that impressed with them. So that's kind of why we're doing this. And at the end of this, we'll shoot one of them out of both guns and kind of show you what the difference is between the Migras and the Federal Speed Shocks. So, Next one up is gonna be the Impala Plus, same choke, Carlson Cremator, and we're gonna go BB and twos instead of the one and threes. All right guys, so this was the Impala Plus with the Migra three inch, two and BB load actually pretty impressive man i'm kind of surprised that it ended up like that so part of the reason we wanted to do this was because i said to jake on our last hunt that it just felt like we were knocking more birds down with this migra and um that's pretty impressive at 40 yards especially compared to the speed shock test that i did last year so we'll keep moving along here same thing here impala plus carlson cremator long range these are the migra two and four load It's still working. Send it back. <laughs> oh shit. Dude, what are the odds? All right, well, we're up here looking at the two and four and I can tell you, man, this is, I'm just thoroughly impressed with these Migras and this setup and combo right now. We're gonna see what happens when we switch it over to a Jebs. But so far, man, it's pretty impressive. I mean, hard to beat at 40. So on a quick count, it looks like we have 54 pellets on that paper, which, I mean, that isn't anywhere close to a 30-inch circle. But it's pretty representative of what I feel like a goose body would be. So, I mean, it's only going to get better from there, really. All right, guys, so the last one up, Impala Plus, Carlson Cremator Long Range, and these are going to be the Federal Speed Shock BB. Um, 
these are one and a quarter ounce so pretty similar we'll see what happens this is what we shot all last year interested to see what it's going to do between the two here all right so this is the federal speed shock bb once again man i'm really not that impressed with them like i said we shot these all last year but we got 19 pellets on paper 20 pellets on paper so the migras seem to be outperforming and that's obviously going to be because of the stacked load you know i would say that that's the majority of why we're getting more on paper you just have more pellets so here's what the speed shock looked like once again not absolutely horrible but at 40 yards i mean you really don't have that much hit in that that paper so next up is going to be the impala plus with the jebs high voltage which is in a 690 constriction so we're going to run through all those same loads same gun different choke and see what happens <laughs> 